Hello everyone. My name is Willie the Bam Johnson. That's the poster for the new documentary called The Bam, The Willie Johnson Story. You can check it out at the um, Maverick YouTube channel or pick up your DVDs that are available out right now. But um, I just wanted to once again say hello, taking a break from the podcast, the Warrior Mindset um, podcast today and zooming in to um, some little Facebook Live, some, you know, Instagram Live and, you know, Twitter and things like that. And my subject of discussion today is the BAM story. And, uh, you know, one of the things I want to, you know, emphasize, once again, I'm blessed, I'm thankful. Thank Robert Parham, Maverick Entertainment, all the other people that have been involved with the development of this documentary um, is truly my testimony. It's my truth. You know, it's my authentic expression of an element of my life that was revealed at that particular time and moment. There's a lot more that, you know, of course, we haven't been able to get out on there, but we gave you enough just to truly understand why I do what I do. You know, why I live and I breathe and I push each and every day to be the person that I am today. You know, the BAM is an acronym for the Better Attitude Makers, and that's what it is all about. Wherever we go, we got to make people, places, and things much better and so much better than what they were before we came. You know, one of the things I want to, you know, do once again as I, you know, stick to my notes here, because I really want to talk to people. First of all, once again, I want to say thank you to everyone. Thank you to all the people that are out there and came and supported, then watched it, then viewed it, for the people that gave me a thumbs up, and for the people that gave me a thumbs down. You know, I got to remember one thing, and this is, you know, evident in the documentary, self-love is so important. It's so important to love yourself, respect yourself, care about yourself, cherish yourself, to thy own self be true. You know, I spent so much time in my life trying to people please and, you know, and push and hope that people would love me, support me, back me, you know, not count me out, but count me in. I spent all my time wasting my time trying to convince people to love me. And it wasn't until I got incarcerated that I really learned how to love me, become my best friend, you know, learn to appreciate me. And most importantly, give me a thumbs up for telling my truth and telling that truth so I can empower the youth. You know, odds have always been against me. That's what this documentary talks about, you know. But when you come up the way I come up, you know, you learn how to flip the script. You got to overcome the odds, the obstacles that we all, we all are facing obstacles. We all got odds stacked against us. It doesn't matter your color, your race, your creed, but you got to understand, you know, that battle that you got within front of you. Most importantly, the ones that you got inside of you. And this documentary, along with the book called The Commandments of Personal Safety, is giving you the tools and all the things you need to fight through and do what you got to do to overcome Get to the other side so you can be a beacon uh, of strength, uh, you know, hope, transformation, opportunity. You understand what I'm saying? And this journey has truly defined my purpose, my why. I recognize when I was locked up, when I was incarcerated, and I said to myself, I said, God, if you give me another chance in 1989 and allow me to push forward, and become a better person, God, please allow me to stay alive in this jail cell. You know, locked down for 23 hours, let out for one. If you give me a chance to find my truth, and if some kind of way I end up practicing martial arts, I know that's my purpose, to use martial arts in some shape and some form to empower other people and uplift other people and guide the next generation. And you know what? Those things came to me through writing books, through writing rhymes, raps, through writing, you know, movies, writing plays, doing whatever I can possibly do to write on toilet paper, you know, newsletters, whatever was available to me, along with working out, working in the kitchen, everything that I needed to do to fix my weaknesses and build on my strengths, I did at that moment. And today, after 37 years, this is a manifestation of that. 
So, you know, that truth, that testimony that I'm sharing in that documentary is my truth to empower other people. Love you. Learn to tell your truth. Tell your testimony. To uplift. Most importantly, to free yourself from yourself and then uplift other people, giving them the tools to be able to do the exact same thing. The biggest fight has always been within me. It has always been me against me. Even to this day, I still fight through it. But that's why we use the warrior's mindset, the 12 steps, the 12 transformational things that I do each and every day. That's based upon every month of the year, every week, you know, and every day. These affirmations, these steps, the things I need to do that goes beyond just business. It's, it's being complete. 360 degrees of transformation, 360 degrees of knowledge. That's what this is all about. That's the fight. Forget fighting someone else. As Champ Nichols said to me one time, Damon John speaking manager, he said, bruh, if whatever you're showing me or anybody, we got to get on our hands and knees and fight, then it ain't worthy of learning. Show me something where I can prevent that. I ain't trying to fight. Nobody want to go back and, and go in those, those, those hells and those demands. You have to, you can, but who wants to? It's about the art of fighting without fighting. And that's what this is all about. So learn to fight through. First and most importantly, learn to understand your truth. Understand what your weaknesses are and understand what your strengths are. Flip them, use them, and use those weaknesses as stepping stones to impact and turbocharge your strengths. You understand what I'm saying? You know, one of the things that I, I also look at too, you know, we, we always constantly striving and pushing forward and saying, ah, I ain't getting that. I ain't understanding that story. The one thing that I can say, and I thank all of you for saying, man, that's my story, bam. That's my pain, bam. That's something I never dealt with, bam. Yes, we are more alike than different. This ain't just about, you know, what is it? Martial arts and being a man and being a father, being a husband, being a community leader, being a businessman is everything. It's the whole makeup until I realize that I am complete. I don't put something over here and lift it up when I go over there. I am what I am. I am Willie Johnson, the band. I go out and I do what I need to do each and every day to be a manifestation of that. From when I walk into my dojo with my family, when I wake up, when I'm on a radio show, when I'm on a movie set, when I'm writing a book, when I'm doing everything, I will never be a fake any, anymore. I will never perpetrate. I will never hide my truth. Never again. To thy own self, be true. Be true to yourself. Spend time learning to master you. Learning to speak your truth. So we can connect and realize once again that we're more alike than different. Is the pain, the joy, the happiness, the sorrow that connects us all. That's beyond color, race, and creed. They ain't got no colors on them. They ain't got no sex on them. They ain't got no religion on them. They ain't got no creed on, on them. They, those are emotions. Genuine, universal emotions that we all feel and will feel. It must learn to control and overcome pain, sorrow, egotism, pride, all those things. But the ultimate is peace, harmony, and happiness from the inside out. So give yourself a thumbs up. Even if you want to give me a thumbs down, give yourself a thumbs up. Clap for yourself. When I used to compete, I never would watch people performing because I always said, I turn my back. Because while they're clapping and yelling, they talking about me. they clapping for me. They just ain't seen me yet. So I can't see who else going. Because then it's going to make me think about them. Nah, those claps are for me. Clap for you. Give yourself a thumbs up. Give yourself a pat on the back. Hug yourself. Love yourself. To thy own self be true. Remember, that's what this is all about. The BAMs, the documentary. Check it out. Pick up the book, The Commandments of Personal Safety, The Commandments of Knowing How. Those are separate from the, the, the Warrior Mindset Principles. Those Warrior Mindset Principles is you learning how to protect you from you. The Commandments is now trying to teach you safe, being aware of these things that are going on around that you ain't paying attention to. You understand what I'm saying? Walk your post in a perfect manner. Be alert. You know what I'm saying? Take charge of your body language, your attitude, and your spirit. See the world with your third eye. So life is good. Just wanted to check in, giving everybody a thumbs up. Even though 